really wet here. <laughs> Hi, I'm Chris. I make videos for my YouTube channel Battery Life and I test electric cars and my goal was always to inform people of the future purchase of an electric car so they know everything range charging how the car drives what it does with the infotainment system heating cooling and stuff like this but not just info i also wanted to give you a bit of entertainment maybe a story a lifestyle around electric cars but there's a big problem with that i still work here 40 hours a week i'm in this warehouse I'm in charge of this warehouse, what comes in, what goes out, how it's maintained and everything. I'm mostly alone. So working 40 hours a week here and then try to make entertaining videos is sometimes a bit hard. <laughs> Filming a video like this takes a bit of time and I don't have that right now. But at some point in time, I don't know when, maybe I can live off YouTube get my all I need from YouTube to survive and then my goal is to make videos like this But let's get to the main topic that I want to talk about, the charging infrastructure in Germany. It's not very good, <laughs> not at all. I mean, it's improving every year, S steady pace, but not amazing. Um, we have a lot of 22 kilowatt type two AC chargers in the city where you need your own cable. Or triple chargers like this. It's a CCS 50 kilowatt, a Chatmo 50 kilowatt, and an AC Type 2 22 or 43 kilowatt depends. And those chargers are on the highway, but on, on, no, only on on the big gas stations right on the highway and a few in the city. Not too many, and they're not very well maintained. And it's not a lot, so it's one charger. So a car, uh, two cars can charge here. One with AC, one with DC, and that's it. And we have a few Ionity chargers or other chargers, so EMBW and Allego are making chargers on the highway or on, on very busy country roads where you have more than just one charger and you have a charger that charges 100, 150 or even 350 kilowatt. But that's not enough. We need more. We have a million electric cars in Germany, soon to be way more i mean electric cars are on the rise the charging infrastructure is just not good but <laughs> the german government had a plan called deutschland Netz or germany net i want to call it infrastructure what they want to do they have a plan of around thousand charging locations each with a minimum of four chargers some even up to 16 all high power chargers minimum of 200 kilowatt ccs of course the goal is that wherever you are in germany almost uh, in 10 minutes you can reach a high power charger and the cool thing is they put a price limit on it maximum 44 cent euro cent per kilowatt hour and everything has to be done in the end of 2023. And that's awesome! Oh, and by the way, next week I will be getting a Model Y, Tesla Model Y from a patron of mine. Very, very nice guy. I will have it for over the weekend. 
intend of, uh, to test everything, a live stream, so subscribe if you don't want to miss that. And if you want early access to my videos and want to know stuff that's behind the videos or what uh, companies are telling me when I ask them for a car or something, become a Patreon. It's a fun thing. <laughs> we have very nice people there, it's a very nice community and I really provide stuff for my Patreons because they're so nice and support me. Link is in the description below. I will now do a, a charging loss test with the ID3, charge it with different power, AC and DC, I mean at home only AC, but 2 kilowatt, 5, 11, and then on a 50 and then a 350 kilowatt charger and see, uh, always from 50 to 100 percent, see how much charging loss we have. But that's it for me, thank you much for watching, have a great day and take care, bye! <coughs> well, that's gross. We have a lot of one and a half years, no, 